Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. It's Red Hurricane Basketball. Today's program furnished by funding from Gallows, Italian Villa, Wilmington Road, Newcastle. Today's programming provided by Geno's Grocery Deli Lottery. Convenient and on your way. Geno's in Mahoningtown. Today's programming was provided from funding from the Crane Room Grill and Banquet Center, 3009 Wilmington Road. A special thanks to the Crane Room for their participation. Special thanks to Butts, Flowers, Gifts, and more in downtown Newcastle for their support and funding of this program. Butts, Flowers, downtown Newcastle. Programming provided through funding from Daimyo and Olson Law Group with offices in Elwood City and in Newcastle in the Washington Center. Daimyo and Olson Law Group. Funding provided by Main Street Clothiers and Tailors. Washington Street, Newcastle. NCTV 45, the train, anytime. Hello and a very pleasant good evening. We're at the friendly confines of the Newcastle Fieldhouse and excuse our camera difficulty, but we're panning just to show you the capacity crowd we have on hand here tonight for the Beaver Falls Newcastle contest. We uh, initially went through the senior night festivities and we'll be showing those to you at halftime as we go along. Also to note that because of the capacity crowd and in that last shot you could see the visiting radio booth and we're shooting from what was the old Newcastle WKSD booth. It is so tight that our microphones, we had to redub the game because of the fact that the microphones went out. We were getting bad reverb and uh, quite a few few noises as uh, the senior night was introduced. That's why we have taken this opportunity to uh, refix our audio, get ready for the welcome of the Canes, show the game to you in its entirety with those great sponsors that have been so gracious in keeping community television alive and well in Newcastle. Now um, we're going to be waiting for the introductions and uh, we'll be back in this brief moment.
Now, Newcastle will be wearing the white uniforms, and Beaver Falls will be in their black uniforms with orange trim. Colors of both teams very, very similar with the black, white, and the only difference is the red and the orange. As we get ready for the game, you can see the canes warming up. And uh, I can't stress enough just how tight <laughs> everybody's packed in to this field house. What a wonderful evening for basketball, and we look forward to bringing it to you right here on NCTV 45. We'll uh, keep you posted as we work to regain our audio. I know that we'll have it in the second quarter, quarter and throughout the rest of the show. should improve the sound quite a bit. I'm looking for a text from those people out there chatting and we are in a very confined location. But I feel good about our setup. Thanks to all the people at Alderdice and Pittsburgh Public Schools. This is bonus coverage. The Alderdice Dragons will be in white. Newcastle's wearing the black uniforms. This is a JV game. The score is 27-25. And... Uh, We're uh, looking for a sound check. As we check. 
check back. So many <coughs> people joining the NC TV 45 family tonight. Special thanks to Little Johnny's 2 downtown who provided funding for this program. Funding for this program provided by Washington Center Physical Therapy, 
Norm A. Gabriel, MSPT, ATC owner. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Today's programming was provided from funding for all the neighbors in life. Talk to State Farm agent Michael Joseph in Newcastle. State Farm is there. Today's programming was provided from funding from this program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. Okay. The older dice dragons, their colors are green and white. And boy, do they have some sports. Basketball, baseball, and football, of course, but they got crew. As I look for the different things that you don't usually see, lacrosse, ultimate frisbee. There are the Canes taking it out of bounds. Now we're moments away from the Ball start of in. our game. Almost As you can see, the Canes warming up. For the Canes. Uh, notice underneath. The, uh, off the rim, no good. And in the doorways, Back the amount of front. people. Uh, Goes to the just a great Canes evening for high school basketball. And uh, we're going to get our national anthem in here. And uh, we will be uh, let, taking, letting you take out, a look at the warm up and the festivities. And then we will return. Inside with layup. Fixed audio, as you can see, 30, both teams heading to the benches. The, uh, the national anthem, we apologize for not being able to bring that to you. And the sights of the sounds of the pregame. I know how important that is. Uh, we, we couldn't pick up the public address announcement on this because of the cr overflow crowd hitting our microphones. But... Um, Hang in there, and uh, the audio will be ready for the start of the game. Newcastle's first shot up, back of the rim, and rolls out. Second shot banks in. Whistle. Looks like a lane violation. Scoreboard stays 30-25, four minutes and three seconds. Down court, two-point shot, no good. Drive spin, no good. Traveling called on the Dragons. They took a few short steps for Dragons. Little humor there. Couldn't resist. You know, Dragons being large, they usually take big steps. Down court with the Canes. Dribble drive. Pass to the left wing. 336 and moving. Drive back of the rim, no good. Rebound back to the Canes, blocked away, and here come the Dragons, layup, finger roll, got it, 32-25, still three-point shot, back of the rim, no good, foul called. Shot, got it. 
32-25, three minutes on the clock. Steal by the Dragons. Foul by the Canes. They could have heard that all the way down to Strip District. Scores 35-25. Timeout called. Canes trail by 10 with 254 in the third quarter.
well blocked. Kane's trail by 20 with a minute four in the third. Now trail by 20. There's a little walking. Just to give you an idea, as you look down, that's the Canes faithful. And the other side doesn't get any better. Dragons with the ball, Canes with the steal. Underneath, layup missed. A special thanks to the YMCA for caring about the Lawrence County community and providing funding for this program. Thanks to Arlington Market, 726 Arlington Avenue, Newcastle, PA. Groceries, lunch meat, fresh cut meats, produce. It's Arlington Market who provided funding for this program. This program, furnished by a grant from Keystone Specialty, Newcastle's party store on Mill Street in Newcastle. Today's program was furnished by a grant from the Beanery Depot and Deli, featuring coffee, made-to-order subs, and snacks. The Beanery Depot and Deli in Mahoning Town. The fourth quarter with the score 47-25 for the JV game. Hope you're enjoying coverage. It's okay to text me every once in a while to wake me up. The bells ring in my ear as I'm wearing two headsets so I can see the text coming in. And Frank, since you're listening, say hello to Bucky Richards for me. Tell my Dukes and my Irish are both winning. Hard to decide what clothes to wear.
start the fourth. 47-25, Canes Trail. going to go out to uh, Taylor Alderdice. Walking called. Keynes will get the ball. ball out. Ball passed inside, layup, no good. Canes fight for the rebound. They got it. Bailey clears, and here come the Canes. Underneath, layup, in and out, off the leg of a dragon, and it's going to be Canes' ball. camera adjustment. 
adjustment there. Shot around the rim and no good. Second shot, no good. Dragons with the rebound. Charge called on Taylor Alderdice. Out of bounds to the Kings. out front with the ball, 4.16 on the clock, they're down 20. Alderdice playing a great man to man. for the Canes up and good. Second shot. That's got it too. 35-53.
Dragons. Thanks to Arlington Market, 726 Arlington Avenue, Newcastle, PA. Groceries, lunch meat, fresh cut meats, produce. It's Arlington Market who provided funding for this program. Today's program was furnished by a grant from the Beanery Depot and Deli featuring coffee made to order subs and snacks the beanery depot and deli in mahoning town today's program furnished by funding from bill's bake shop where smiles are everywhere 39.53 a minute 48 following the canes pushing
we just, uh, I feel secure now. <laughs> Minute eight, 55 42. And I'm going to do something never heard of before. I'm going to call Little Johnny's downtown in Newcastle as we're watching the game and uh, let Chris know that the game is on. We emailed the link. They have it on in Crane Room. I talked to I talked to them at Cedars. And uh, so we have uh, shooting for Taylor Alderdice with a minute six. First one. Yes, we're NCTV 45. We're calling to let Chris know that the game is on. We've emailed him the link, and people can come to Little Johnny's 2 downtown and watch the game. He said he was going to be on the phone, but I'll just leave you with that uh, little message, and you tell Chris. There you go. And uh, 53 seconds left. Alderdice drives for the layup in and out. Canes get the ball. 56-42, there's a foul. Canes will be shooting. Jalala and 
McCartney Crane Room, DiCaprio Cleaning, Daimio and Olson Law Group, Ferrone Brothers, Gallows, Geno's, Infocision, Keystone Specialty, see Chris for all your party needs, Little Johnny's 2 Downtown Main Street Clothiers, Mobile Auto Detailing, The Mad Unit, Mr. Pizza, who reminds you that it's Ash Wednesday, and they have their tuna fish subs on special on Wednesday for lunch, and, uh, this program, furnished by a grant from Keystone Specialty, Newcastle's party store on Mill Street in Newcastle. Today's program, furnished by funding from Bill's Bake Shop, where smiles are everywhere. Mr. Pizza provided a grant for this program. Mr. Pizza, East Washington Street. Today's program was paid for by a grant from Pegley's Pasta and More, East Washington Street in Newcastle. Today's programming was provided through funding from DiCaprio Cleaners. DiCaprio Cleaners in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Paul D. Weller Hardware in Mahoningtown for providing funding for this program. Today's programming furnished by a grant from Chalala and Carney Florist on Mill Street in Newcastle. This program furnished by a grant from Ferrone Brothers. Two locations, Newcastle on Mill Street and Wilmington Road in Newcastle. Today's programming was provided from funding for, for all the neighbors in life. Talk to State Farm agent Michael Joseph in Newcastle. State Farm is there. Mr. Pizza provided a grant for this program. Mr. Pizza, East Washington Street. Today's programming provided by Geno's Grocery Deli Lottery. Convenient and on your way. Geno's in Mahoningtown. Funding for this program provided by Washington Center Physical Therapy, Norm A. Gabriel, MSPT, ATC owner. Today's special was ham and cheese, so if you're enjoying one of those ham and cheese subs watching the game, I envy you. Pegley's Pasta and More, Paul D. Weller, Sporting Goods, Tuscany Square, the YMCA, Washington Center Physical Therapy. Norm Gabriel, a shout out to Norm. Hope you're doing well this evening. Melva's Deja Vu and State Farm Michael Joseph Agent. And uh, as we read the text as it come in, you know, uh, just a lot of great words. Thanks for all the help back home. And uh, I hate to tell them how many tickets they could have sold if this gym was bigger. There you go to give you an idea. That's below us under the hoop. And uh, that's the other side. And as we get to this side, 
you'll see that it looks exactly the same. Good evening and welcome to Senior Night 2016 in recognition of their talents, abilities, and appreciation of their hard work and dedication with pride in their accomplishment, we applaud our seniors and we would like to start the introductions with senior members of the boys and girls basketball team. The senior members of the boys team are and we'll read these as follows. Chris Dorman, escorted by Gregory Stewart and Chris Dorman Sr. Micah Felina. Escorted by Paul and Karen Felina. Markel Hooker. Escorted by Angela Dennis and Giselle Dennis. Patrick Meninock. Escorted by Pat Meninock Sr. and Roberta Meninock. Branda Parchman. Escorted by Carmen Dennis and Rodney Parchman Sr. Tim Brandon Sr., Senior Basketball Manager, also member of the bowling team, escorted by Tim Brandon Sr. and Tiffany Brandon. The senior members of the girls basketball team, Abba Frenzel, escorted by Henry and Tracy Frenzel. The senior members of the cheerleading squad are Catlin, Caitlin Adamo, escorted by Anthony and Janet Adamo. Tay Bailey, escorted by Tammy and Maurice Bailey. Marissa Caldalesi, escorted by Chris and Renee Caldalesi. Taylor Deep, escorted by John and Pam Deep. Natalie DeVincennis, escorted by Roberta and Brandon DeVincennis. Mackenzie Gold, escorted by Jim and Heather Spencer. Erica Harder, escorted by Bruce and Michelle Harder. Rachel McNichol, escorted by Jason and Stacy McNichol. Jarek Morrison, escorted by Catherine Kumro and James Morrison. Rebecca Nasera. Escorted by Lynn Nasera. Nicole Priscelli, escorted by Matt and Renee Priscelli. Anita Respress, escorted by Tracy McFay and Anthony Respress. Natalie Weinshank, escorted by Todd and Lisa Weinshank. Jerry Ann Zona, escorted by Jerry and Denise Zona. The senior members of Student Council. Roger Jones, Vice President, escorted by Roger and Allison Jones. Shana K. Cunningham, Secretary, escorted by Beverly Brothers. The Senior Class Representatives. 
James Humphrey, escorted by Bill and Karen Humphrey. I'm going to take a break. I'm going to keep the camera focused on center court. And the Jared Budai, vice president, escorted by John and, and Linda uh, Budai. We'll stop back in a short second. Marsha Matthews, treasurer, escorted by Misty Klingensmith and Tyree Haley Horch Horchler, escorted by Elizabeth McFarland and Joe Kanji. Curtis Alley, historian, escorted by Tina Alley. The senior members of Pep Band. Are and, uh, Alicia Byers, also a member of the bowling team, escorted by James and Deborah Byers. Markel Hooker. Christian Chaplin, this, this escorted by a Teresa Chaplin. Event. Joe Monaco, escorted by Michael Denise Felina. and Stephanie Monaco. Michelle Fells, escorted by Susan Fells. Absolutely tremendous evening here. The senior members of the bowling team. At Alderdice. Cordell That's Hawkins, escorted by John and Amy Hawkins. Taylor Heasley, escorted by Jeff and Leanne Heasley. Aaliyah Wilford, escorted by Amy Wilford. The seniors not able to participate tonight are Hunter Fershaw, Chris Johnston, Stephen Kozinski, Cassandra Moss, Cody Papa, Dan Rhodes, no. Brandon Robinson, we thank you all for your hard work and dedication. Let's give them another round of applause. Thank you. And I'm not afraid to mention it, as they honored the away team, and I've never seen that done anywhere. And I've been to quite a few games.
they introduced the seniors on senior night and honoring the Newcastle seniors at the same time. Extraordinary right now is the word that comes to mind. As I peer down, it looks like they have two, maybe four more seniors to introduce.
looks it like it's in for the seniors. When you take a look at the size of the team, you quickly understand why they only lost one game in three years. It's uh, 728. Now it's 728, and I missed kind of what he said about the start of the game. Today's programming was provided from funding from this program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Today's programming was provided from funding from For all the neighbors in life, talk to State Farm agent Michael Joseph in Newcastle. State Farm is there. This program was provided through funding from Cedars Restaurant in Newcastle, Pennsylvania. A special thanks to Cedars featuring Middle Eastern, Italian, and American cuisine. Today's programming was provided from funding for, for all the neighbors in life. Talk to State Farm agent Michael Joseph in Newcastle. State Farm is there. This program furnished by the MAD unit. Mobile auto detailing. See Michael Sad at the madunit.com. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV 45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station.